Imagine you are 20 years old, you've lost your girlfriend, and you live in a foreign country. You're heading back home to Australia, and you get off the plane, and there's no one there to greet you. You see other people getting hugs, but you stand alone. Feeling the need to be connected, you grab a piece of cardboard, and you write free hugs on it. You stand there alone, vulnerable, and simply wanting to know that you matter to someone. A woman came up to him and said she had just had her dog put down and desperately needed one. He knew the power of a hug. Hi guys, good morning. So here I am, I'm in New York. It's World International Hug Day. Since it's 4 a.m., yes, I wanna have my morning coffee. I know it's dark, but let's go out and let's see how Times Square looks like when it's morning 4 a.m. Hi guys, here I am, I'm in Times Square. It's 6 a.m. I've started with my cough. Can't believe how illuminated this place is. There's just a different vibe altogether here in uh, New York Times Square. To make sure when you are in New York, you have to come to this place. So I'll be walking around, I'm gonna go for another coffee and some more photographs. All right, watch out. Hi guys, so here I am, I'm in front of Empire State Building. I was walking all the way from Times Square. I had nothing in my mind, I was just uh, going to take some shots um, around the city and then I found myself right over here in front of Empire State Building. And it's really, really, really uh, cold, but at the same time, it's beautiful weather. So that's a platform building right behind me. It's very famous. I'm sure you have seen in any of the movies which was shot in New York. Uh, on my right hand side is Madison Square, which is very famous. It's 7:15 a.m. and it's getting amazing. People are going for cycling. People are going for jog, and I'm just loving the entire vibe. So that's platform building for you guys. I'm in Brooklyn right now. That's Manhattan Bridge. Uh, right, that side is Brooklyn Bridge. I have the entire skyline of Manhattan City. It's time to head back in Times Square. 1 p.m. is what we have all decided to meet with our free hug banner. Initially, it was only me and Will, and then other members started joining us. It's quite obvious people are hesitant and looking at us with doubt, but slowly, we started getting and giving hugs. Some people even came running. The warm smile and just the genuine hug was all we could exchange and feel. One lady came to me and told me, that she's going for a job interview and she really wanted a hug. I wish her all the best. Then there was another girl who was just passing by and she, she just came to me and she said she loved giving hugs. And eventually she just joined us and started giving free hugs to others. It was an experience I think I can't even describe or express right now. Probably you will understand when you will do this. Trust me, it's a beautiful experience. So this was my very first experience standing and holding a free hug sign in a different country and exchanging a lifetime experience by giving free hugs. All thanks to PositiveFocus.com for inspiring me and many others through their website. Wade and Sundar for creating this beautiful event and Carol C.C. Miller for explaining the power of hugs through YouTube videos. Will I do this again? You know the answer.